Oh, there's nothing sadder than a cat person without a cat. Luckily, it looks like that's about to change. Oh, it's a kitty. And she's so fluffy. Something tells me that's not rain. Whatever it is, it's coming with a chance of kittens. Ooh, are you having a tom or a queen? Two of each? Mommies in the making need lots of love and attention. Especially when they start shedding. Don't worry, our cat brush will fix you right up. This'll catch all that excess hair. Ew. And disposal couldn't be easier. Who wants a paw rub? Let's tuck you in and count some white mice. Huh, this curtain just sparks inspiration. From table to fort, a cat fort. Complete with a big fluffy teddy bear. Bring those two bear paws together. And keep them that way. Add a cushion. It's your own little chair in your own little corner. Wow, construction's thirsty work, you know. No, but save some water. It's just what our toilet water dish needs. So fresh and clean, you'll want to sip for yourself. Don't forget some TP, always comes in handy. After all, accidents do happen. Some kibble will pair great with all this water. Oh, there's a prize. Oh, we found Nemo. Of course, every fish needs a bowl. Why not add a little island in the middle? Just add water, too. Now it's all ready for our robot fish. Round and round they go. Ooh, careful! Oh, I think you broke that brush. No matter, those bristles look all right. Just add some glue and it's a new scratching post. Wow, you sure go through a lot of brushes. <laughs> Ugh, we need to get a litter box in here. In the meantime, Ew. it's time for a little 52 pickup. Ew. Looks like she's got an idea. And just in time, too. Start by cutting a little door on the side. <laughs> Maybe something in this old Christmas box will help. No, not this. Not that. Aha! Our tiny Christmas tree. I knew it wasn't such a bad little tree after all. In fact, we'll need a few to cover up the sides. Just lay out the green carpet and a plastic bag. Don't forget to glue it all together. Add some sand, like every litter box needs. <laughs> uh, gravity is just not your friend today. But cardboard is far more agreeable. You can make it into all sorts of new things. All it needs is some old Christmas lights. And why not add a pillow at the bottom? I think your bird shedding must be catching. Eh, loose feathers means crafting supplies. Add this to a string and add some beads.
Let's hang these up like a beaded curtain. And it's the perfect place for all your old gum. <laughs> we should add a pillow on top. And look, there's even a door. We'll need stairs, unless cats can fly. Ooh, nice pom-pom. Can we borrow it? A few of these will brighten up the doorway. Oh, I think Kitty wants to help. Uh, maybe not. Either way, this broom is just what we needed. Take an empty box and fill it up with a bunch of bristles. Pour a little cement on the bottom. Not too much. We want those bristles sticking out, so Kitty can play with them. Uh-oh. Hope we didn't use up all our brooms. Hey, there's something in the plant pot. Oh, it helps you make paw prints. And we've got plenty of paws. This is going right in our collage. Ooh, beach balls on tap. Now that's fancy. But let's not forget about all that string either. Wrap it around and glue it into place. Now all we need is something to stand it on. And something sharp. Don't worry, I said we've got them on tap. Cut an opening. It'll help get the ball out. And your kitty cat in. Wow, someone tell that ostrich we found her egg. It looks like it's ready to hatch. Let's help. Ooh, confetti. And a cute baby duck. Sure had a lot of room in there. Mm -hmm. Looks like someone's got a new best friend. Meanwhile, let's have fun with all this laundry. These green tights are just what we needed. Start by folding one into the other. And tie them to these chair legs. You've got a little hammock right in your room. <laughs> so who wants to try it out? Any takers? What happened to our feline friend? Well, at least we've got a sock. So many holes. Let's make some more. Take these tubes and add frills toward the end. <laughs> Accessorize and your kitty friend's got a brand new outfit. Put your paw through and you're photo ready. Hmm. Perfect time for a snack break. But first, let's have some fun with the container. We really just need the bottom. It works even better than tracing paper. Draw the outline and then color it in. When you're finished, cut it out. Leave some room to punch a hole in at the top. Now we just need to add some heat. This will shrink things down to size. It's the right size for our new necklace. All dressed up for a nice night at home. <laughs> Your brand new cat home. Let's explore. Wow, those cats know how to live. Guess somebody's got some cat scratch fever. Now that's a bear hug. Time to descend the stairs like you just had a makeover. And there's so many places to catnap. But I think this is her favorite spot. <laughs> wow. 
Remember to order that big liter of milk and a 20-pound salmon. Good. Now, does the cat want anything? Pretty cool stuff. Catch you next time. Hello, Mr. Strawberry. Are you ready for your facial? Ooh, it looks like a beard transplant. Well, he always wanted to be one of those cool shaven Kens. I've got the feeling he's gonna choose Pikachu. I mean, he is a mouse. Wow, he never just stays in his ball like that. Let's thank him by giving him a nice, cushy seat. In both senses of the word. Gunk all over. When it comes to peas, you don't need a whole pod. You can have tons of fun with just one. Hey, that rhymes. But what's really fun to play with is a balloon. Blow it up. You know, we can use it to make a pea pod too. Let's start out by making three. Now tape them together. For extra fun, let's draw some faces on them. Hey, my spaces are still faces. Now give it a good squeeze. All the cats are coming out for this. What a pretty dolly. Let's give her a haircut. I was thinking a pixie cut, but bald is beautiful. Now let's trim some whiskers. Wait, hold on. We can whip you up a new weave. Be careful, you might feel a slight pinch. Ooh, who says blondes have more fun? Sometimes you just gotta think pink. Mm, cherry flavored. A plastic cup with nothing inside. What a waste of a good cup. So let's have some fun. Draw something on it. It's a tiny pair of shades. And look, they come in your size. Who says hole punches can only come hole shaped? Especially when you can get the gold star, among other prizes. Let's see how he looks with a few beauty marks. But why not save some for yourself, too? Enjoy your cat nap? Surprise! We've never looked better. And cats already look good, thanks to all that beauty sleep. As every cat knows, it's kind of hard to top a ball of yarn. But we're always up for a challenge. Let's add it inside a balloon. What else? Ooh, glitter. And some clear glue. Ooh, it's nice and squishy. What else can we try? Ooh, ice cream. It's got a nice smile, but let's give it a bigger mouth. Oh, it's nice and hollow. So let's squeeze our squishy ball inside. When it's ready, give it a good squeeze. Just because that one cat wore a hat doesn't mean they all do. All cats have their own sense of style. Some prefer to sparkle and shine. And also wear wigs. And don't you worry, there's plenty of sparkle to go around. Oh no! Cola is a terrible thing to waste. Careful, you don't want any sticky paws. Don't worry, just blow up a balloon. And deflate it into a brand new glove. 
You could just lap it up, but cats prefer milk. Hmm, you sure that bowl's big enough? Then again, you can't beat drinking straight from the source. We might not have the whole cow, so we'll settle for the others. Bubbles are so fleeting, so let's make a bunch. Here's an idea. Take a bottle and a straw. No, we're not blowing bubbles in chocolate milk. Especially since we're cutting them up. Place pieces of straw inside the bottle top. Use a rubber band to attach it to an electric fan. Now just give it a dip in some bubble solution. Time to turn on your DIY bubble machine. Ah, the artist at work. Let's add some red, yellow, blue. It's SpongeBob. I knew that cat had good taste. Time for Sponge to meet Squeegee. Gotta love that underwater work. Our little archaeologist is hard at work searching for treasure. Just add a little water, not too much. Now time to air dry. Time for some elbow grease. I think cats have elbows, right? A running mouse? Let's see if it lives up to its name. Oh, look at it go. No wonder it's so much fun chasing him. I'm starting to understand where the term cat burglar came from. Just what is our furry little friend up to? Ooh, a balloon. I guess he likes it on the frosty side. It's like a pinata. Just scratch it open and collect your prizes. Congratulations. Careful, you might chip a tooth. Oh, now where's that blow dryer? Oh, even better, a hammer. It's time for a little smashing. Make that a lot of smashing. Careful, you don't want to break your stuff. What a good idea. We've still got ice left over. After all, I am feeling a little parched. Time to do a little gardening. Look at that cucumber. Let's clean it up. Keep it lined up. We're gonna start slicing. Or would you prefer to pickle it first? We're only cutting partway through for now. Flip it over so we can cut the bottom half. Why not? Keeps the board scratch-free. Careful, we're not cutting all the way through, you know. Because it's much more fun to make a spiral. Hey, squash can come in spaghetti. And why should squash have all the fun? Caterific stuff. Catch you next time. Happy birthday. Oh, and look. This one's got air holes. It's a puppy. Oh, a toy puppy. <laughs> kind of a misleading box. Well, we can still play with it. Let's give it a bath. Sweet Jiminy Crickets. Your love made it a real dog. Thank you, Blue Fairy, wherever you are. Maybe we should wait before we break it to mom. Just a few seconds old, and he's already got bugs. Ew. 
Time to break out the tweezers. Wow, some of these bugs are big enough for a hands-on approach. Ew, someone's got dog breath. Well, don't worry. We've got a brush just for you. Canines are pretty important to canines. Maybe that's how they got the name. Now let's clean up the whole row. Huh, what have you been eating? Now it's time for the other kind of brush. Oh, soon enough, we'll have enough to make a new dog. Quick, let's hide you. Come on. If anyone asks, you're a pile of clothes. Just stay still. Hey. Did you have a nice birthday, honey? What the? Oh, she's just shedding and then dyeing the hair. Hmm. Uh. Wow, I can't believe that worked. Ew. Sort of. Either way, it's time for a little spring cleaning. Let's pile it up. Now where's a carpet to sweep it under? Ooh, your pants could use a good swipe too. Uh -huh. Wow, the puppy's really good at hiding. Seriously. Oh, this isn't good. Let's follow that trail of chewed up clothes. Well, dogs like to dig, and dig they shall. Come on, we need to clean those dirty paws. This device should help. It's a shower and a brush all in one. What a good dog. Most would have had five escape attempts by now. Let's dry you off. Well, that's one way. But let's try this bathrobe. And if mom asks, you're a shark. And for being such a good boy, you get a face massage. But don't let the name fool you. It can massage more than just your face. I think there's time to have a turn of your own, too. Wait, I'd be careful about taking a nap. Hey. Nothing to see here, just us toys. Yeah, mom needs to check those glasses. Now what did we say about naps right now? I'm sure we can sew them back up. But for now, let's trim those nails. Okay, that didn't work. Time for plan B. Ah, plastic wrap. Now it's a plastic cap. Some peanut butter should please our furry friend. Now he won't notice the mani-pedi. Hey, where are you going? Why couldn't mom fill up on birthday cake like the rest of us? What? You forgot the ketchup. Well, someone doesn't mind. At least you still got your ketchup. Silly doggy. Thinks he's people. No. Here's something for you. A kibble dispenser. It's dinner time with the press of a button. Bon appetit. And don't forget, moms have to eat too, you know. What? Eh? A living room's like a city to this pupper. Ooh, look at wow. all these boxes. Let's have some fun. We can make a whack-a-mole game, but with treats. Besides, moles bite. Quick, hide, it could be moles. Come on. We're in the clear. Yeah. Time to relax with a good book. Let's see. Wow, wow that koala sure likes eucalyptus. Aw. Why don't you come up for story time? Uh -huh. Hmm, good point. How do you get up? Uh -huh. hmm. Great wow. idea. This doggy staircase should help. Come on, it's easy. Just one step at a time. 
Hold on a sec. I think nature's calling. Though someone needs to keep an eye on him. Make that something. This camera should help. Okay, let's try it out. It's all on your phone. Yeah, I never liked those shoes either. Green with green dots? Huh, he did you a favor. Oh, no. Still, uh -huh. this sniffing mat should distract him. Especially when you add surprises inside. Pockets just make everything a little bit better. Let's try it out. And while he's distracted, hide your shoes. Except toe shoes, they deserve to be chewed up. Ooh, it looks like shoes aren't the only thing on his diet. But don't worry, now it can be his new collar. Don't you look dapper and selfie ready. This one would make a great ID tag. The glue gun's the perfect laminator. Just cover it with wax paper and flatten it with a rolling pin. Oh, don't you look dapper, doggy? What other looks would you like to try out? Wow! <laughs> well, you heard the answer button. A dragon costume? Look, spikes! Okay then. How about a superhero? We'll just call him Crypto. Uh -huh. Is it a bird? A plane? It's Super Dog! Wow, it's like he really can fly. Well, that was a great workout for both of us. Photo time! The Daily Planet will pay big for this. Ooh, look, an ink pad. Any takers? That's one way to get your John Hancock. Wow, this one's going right on the wall. But here's another way to help him express himself. Add some paint and a clear cover to a canvas. Some dog food on top should help too. Who needs a paintbrush when you've got a nose for art? You know, wall art's a step above refrigerator mm. art. Wait, you shouldn't play with paint. Besides, what you need is a chew toy. And look, it's corn-themed. Smear some food on the kernels. Now this is what you should sink your teeth into. Ooh, look at the mess. There are paw prints everywhere. Okay, actually, I kind of like it, but that's just me. Oh, no! It's worse than I feared! She's got contacts! Now she'll get you, and your little dog, too! A suitcase? Is she sending you packing? Wait a minute. She's making it a doggy bed. It's the best seat in the house. I mean, look, it's portable. <laughs> We've had a lot of fun today wishing toys to life. But be careful. Side effects can include a dog growing 10 feet tall or turning fire engine red. Do not feed after midnight. Consult local gnome for any additional questions or comments. woof a stuff! Catch you next time! You know this Cheetos can put some pep in your step? Just built a little boot around it. Add some paint, or even better, glitter chair. And you've got new lifts. Now get stepping. On second thought, watch your step. 
You got paw prints everywhere. Don't worry. Enough caramel can cover up any blemish. Give it time to harden and you've got candy. Add a stick and it's a lollipop. Or should we say lollipop? Done with that bottle? Good, we can recycle it. Especially that cap. Add clay and a paper dog. This ain't construction paper, color them in! For the eyes, let's go with googly. The gang's all here. Let's get rocking. They just keep going and going and going. <laughs> wow, a dog making dumplings. Eh, still better than mine. Don't worry, that's what our dumpling maker's for. All you need's the dough and filling and voila. You've got a perfectly wrapped dumpling. Careful, that might be the one with kibble. Ooh, a bone! Ooh, an even bigger bone! And ooh, a corgi? Kind of breaking the pattern. But at least he seems fun to play with. Give him a treat and watch what comes out. Ooh, careful where you're aiming that. Oh no, not the cheese puffs. I wouldn't eat that. Ew, someone get this dog a diaper. Wow, a candy machine. Looks like you've caught one. This game's a lot of fun for kids. But as for puffs, not so much. But maybe then can join in on the fun. We can make our own candy machine. Just with kibble instead of candy. Press a button and the treats come pouring in. It's good thing his head fits in. Hmm, I guess someone ran out of candy. Oh no, Monica's missing. Oh, there she is. So, does this mean I get the reward? Guys, I'll get back to you. For now, let's get crafty. Next time she gets lost, she'll have an ID tag. We'll need her name and a contact number. It's kind of big. Let's shrink it down to size. Bake it in the over and bam, it's bite-sized. Just the right size to fit around her neck. <laughs> it's lunchtime. Guess someone doesn't want to share. I know, grab a pop tube and a funnel. And let the food come right to you. Use a bowl to keep everything in one place. Unless, of course, you want to eat off the floor. All done? Well, let's keep it around for dinner. I heard of dog groomers, but not like this. Oh no, you took off the whole eyebrow? It's okay, this toy has plenty of hair to share. He just keeps it in his blackheads. Good. It should be more than enough. But first, he really needs a shave. This is going to take a lot of shaving cream. Time for a rinse. And that's good enough. 
What a good boy. You've earned a treat. Ooh, a hot dog. The last food in the house. I probably shouldn't have mentioned that. It's simple solution. Just split it up. You get a piece and so do you. Hey, what about me? Mmm, pizza. Wait, watch out. Oh, no. Is the pizza okay? We can rebuild it. Fry up the dough. Okay, this might take a while. Good. This face is nice and crispy. But a little makeup wouldn't hurt. No one wakes up looking their best. Take a bite. Just eat around the eyelashes. Oh no! Your wig! I told you to tape it down. Don't worry, we'll make you some new hair. Cut up something purple, like onions. Just as long as she looks like an anime character. Start by whipping them up into spirals. Anyone else starting to tear up? Just me? Let's lie her down and see if we have enough. But save some too. I want onion rings. That should be enough. Looking good. Wow. So where are we on those onion rings? <laughs> Oh, even the tiniest of hearts can be broken. But don't worry, we'll make you a new friend. Literally, just need a glove, a cup, and some markers. Give it a muzzle, and soon you've got a brand new dog. Tuck it inside. Add a hole and a straw and blow it up. She's ready. Time for a meet cute. Emphasis on cute. Wow, they really like hot dogs around here. The chase begins. Get back here. Okay, now I'm starting to get dizzy. Hey, don't give up. Get crafty. Or better yet, crafting. Draw a runner in one circle and their legs in another. Cut off the tip of a straw to connect them together. Now these paper dolls will do all the running for you. Add a background and it's like you're in a cartoon. So who won? Hey, let's call it a draw. Ooh, what's in that giant block shaped box? Oh, that little shirt's sure seen better days. We can spruce it up, get out those felt tip markers. And I mean all of them, make a rainbow. Roll it up and add to water for a nice relaxing soak. Once it dries, help your furry friend become fashion forward. Careful with those paws. Don't you look cute? Well, cuter. And since you're all dressed up, let's dance. Shake that tail. Time for dinner. Now, how did he get in here? Now that's much better. Let's dig in. Could use some gravy. Hmm, what's that smell? Dogs really need to try out the whole litter box idea. 
Well, this pooper scooper looks like it makes things easy. Good job. Probably should sanitize the couch. Still, it looks like we got this scooper just in time. Just how many dogs do you have again? Look at all that rain. Oh no, that poor puppy. We have to save him. Hurry. First things first, let's get you an umbrella. Well, that was easy. Now it's time to get out of this rain. Or go to the park? Well, gotta get in those steps. Good thing there's room enough for two. Uh-oh. And this is why you need to puppy-proof. Either way, you need a bath. Or better yet, a shower. Just plug it in, and you get a spritz and a scratch all in one. This puppy will be clean in no time. Every dog's gonna love the sound of that. Come on, a walk? It's such a great day for napping. Well, if we have to go, this cat will show you how to do it. First, let's try this charming cat carrier. Now this is a walk. The kind where you don't actually walk. Always love a nice ride through the country. Rain again? <laughs> Weather's sure weird around here. On the plus side, you don't need a shower tonight. Let's dry you off before things get even wetter. We just need to put you in this snazzy new outfit. Add a blow dryer to the tail and let the drying commence. Now you and your dog can get your hair done together. You should be done by now. Nice and dry. Wow, a retractable lollipop holder. Wonder what the retracting expert thinks. Well, one man's candy is a cat's face scratcher. Uh-oh, look at all those dirty paws. We'll need to start cleaning at the source. This device should help. Just add soap. Just squeeze out the foam and treat those paws. Don't forget to dry when you're done. And clean that couch. Speaking of paws, it's time for a manicure. Time to use your head. Seriously, wrap it up. And cover it up with some wet pet food? Someone isn't gonna mind cleaning it up. Good, a distraction. Now fix those nails. Don't worry, your dog won't feel betrayed. Especially when they learn there's food left over. This kitty's ready for a close-up, Mr. DeMille. If only cats could have fun costumes to wear. Who said they don't? Just look at this little cap. Release your inner beast. Or maybe get ready for the holidays. Say cheese. I mean, you are wearing mouse ears. Litter boxes seem cleaner, but you still need to clean them. We're gonna need a tool for this. Just don't forget a bag. It'll come in handy. Just scoop things up. Probably should ask the vet about that. Maybe the cat's just hiding its veggies in here. Ooh. 
See, I told you that bag would come in handy. Good thing, too. This box won't stay clean for long. Oh, that reminds us. It's time to exercise. Let's get ready. Get the leash, tie those laces, and head out. Really working up a sweat. Come on, no pain, no gain. Oh, it's time for a break. It's important to hydrate. And I meant that for the both of you. Hmm. Luckily, we've got portable doggy bowls. Granted, bowls are usually portable, but not like this. Don't forget the kibble. Your furry friend totally earned it. Good, all gone. Now you can wrap it up. By the looks of it, somebody wants a muffin. Oh. And they're not going down without a fight. If only we could make a muffin tin treat for pups. Well, just fill each hole with kibble and a toy. Ah, tennis balls. You can never go wrong with tennis balls. Some prefer muffin tops, but this dog can't wait to get to the bottom. Now you're free to dig into those backup muffins. Ugh, where's the light switch? Careful not to trip. Don't worry, your pupper is here to help with a shiny new collar. You can customize the size and add as many as you need. And now your dog's ready for the next rave. Turn off the light. And why not join in on the fun, too? Sorry, Cup, but the cat says you gotta go. Actually, pushing things off tables looks like fun. And these cat paws let you join in on the fun. Let's play with some cat toys while we're at it. The best part, use them to play with your cat. Yeah, that's the spot. Oh no, what cat doesn't come when the treats are shaking? Oh, the toilet, of course. The best seat in the house. Reunited. And it feels mm, suffocating, apparently. Let's use this hanger to help. Cut it up. We'll need to do a little bit of bending. Add a little tape to secure these arches in place. Place on a cardboard base. Just poke through. Cover it up so that it's a little tent. Your cat will never want to leave. And look who's up for a game of catch the finger. Looks like you're about to get a wet one. I'll make that a messy one. What have you been feeding this dog? We need to do something about this canine's teeth. Luckily, we've got a special doggy toothbrush. Looks like your cat's not the only one to get hairballs. Well, if you really need to lick your cat, this should help. Your cat gets a good brushing and no saliva. Clean up's a breeze. Why not groom yourself while you're at it? Hard to get up when you're moonlighting as a chair. But you can't just ghost your own mother. Here's what to do. Grab a pillow and remove the stuffing. Fill up a pair of old jeans you can afford to lose. Keep the legs crossed together. And now, it's time to make the old switcheroo. 
While we're at it, why not make a whole fake person? Now call your mother. Sensational stuff! Catch you next time! Once upon a time, there were two puppies. They were a modern day prince and pauper. Hey, what's that? You found more gold! Quick, follow that money trail! Well, it's golden, but I wouldn't touch it if I were you. Luckily, here's just the thing to keep your paws clean. Do what dogs do best. Start digging. When you're done, they come right off. But if you don't have any booties lying around, cut up a rubber glove. Let's try it out. Go on, get down and dirty. Now let's look at those paws. Either way, those paws are safe. Okay, we need to rethink this fence situation. This new collar will help keep you safe. And look on the bright side. At least it's not a cone. Hmm, what else can help? How about a long bone or stick? Just make sure it sticks out on the sides. Mm -mm. Wow, finger painting without the fingers. Mm -mm. But we should probably clean those paws. Just add water and give it a good scrubbing. Squeaky clean. Ooh, patty cake. Seems like good, clean fun. Ugh, spoke too soon. We need hand sanitizer stat. As for that popper, we can make our own paw cleaner. Just need a scrubbing pad, a cup, and water. Much better. But there's three more to go. And we're done. Remember, patty cake at your own risk. Oh, looks like someone's about to go on a trip. Make sure to tuck that belt in nice and tight. And away we go. Him to the park, sir. Now sit back and unwind. Hmm, you're the perfect fit inside this bag. A few cuts. And it's a custom-made carrier. What you waiting for? Sooner you leave, the sooner you share your pup with the world. Oh, I'm starting to see how they got so rich. Either way, it's time to get scooping. Just wrap a bag around it first. Let's just keep one jewel. Uh, service fee and all. And the job is practically finished. Uh-oh, I don't think he can wait. Don't worry, we can make our own scoop. We just need an old plastic container. Isn't recycling just grand? Some dogs like their kibble shaken, not stirred. Of course, food is all in the presentation. This toy is the dog version of a tiny bit of parsley. Although it's also a lot more fun. It's a game that ends in a treat. And now it's time for round two. Just give it a good push and jackpot! We're in the kibble. Of course, some dogs are fine with a little silver bowl. But deep down, don't all dogs just want to have fun? Try adding kibble to a towel in a pattern. 
roll it up for a mini scavenger hunt. Come on, put that snout to good use. Remember, no treat left behind. An ID tag is very important for puppies. Sure comes in handy when they get lost. You'll never know when you'll need it. I mean, Scooby-Doo still can't find that nephew of his. See? This pup's already home sweet home. And ID tags don't have to be fancy. Make it out of old plastic. You just need to be able to read it. Still, maybe we can shrink it down to size. Add to your pup. And remember, Toto, there's no place like home. Dogs sometimes need to unwind with a little scalp massage. What? Being cute and adorable 24-7 isn't easy. If you don't have the special machine, look no further than your own kitchen. Just take an old whisk and cut it up at the end. Add a little hot glue to give it a tender touch. Let it dry and give that canine cranium a good rub down. With all that fur, it's about time we get to brushing it. And look, this brush makes cleanup a breeze. Still, let's not waste such nice soft fur. So hard to get things in Kissy's size. Ah, our spring cleaning's almost done. Oh, I just had to jinx it. Look at all that hair! We can work harder, or better yet, smarter. Add hot glue drops to a rubber glove. Draw some squiggle lines on the palm. Now you can collect hair right from your puppy before it ends up all over your stuff. Are you thirsty, boy? We can fix that. We've got our very own water dispenser. Here, why don't you wet your whistle? Huh, this plastic bottle isn't really for you, but it can be. Decorate the bottom with hot glue. Pull off, and it's a brand new puppy bowl. Hmm. Who says that laser toys are just for cats? You don't need nine lives to catch mice. Mice are fun and all, but let's try something else. Draw something you know your dog will like using this transparent material. Now let's shine a little light on the situation. Game on! Here's one of the most important parts of pet care, costumes. Otherwise, Halloween's just the end of October. Ooh. This look just needs one thing. Perfect. Even old clothes can become pet outfits. Want to try this on? No? Yes? I guess not. How about something a little more snugly? Yeah, that's a yes. Let's try it on. 
throw on some pants while you're at it. And a hat under the hood? <laughs> Why not? Yes. Any old clothes can look good on a puppy. Some candles will help set the mood for our new puppy massage. Just roll this tool around your dog's face. And maybe that back while we're at it. He's not the only one in need of a massage. But you know, blocks were made for building. Like this puppy back scratcher. Scratch his back and he'll scratch yours. Popperific stuff. Catch you next time.